The Oshun State Chapter of the People's Democratic Party, the PDP, has secured an ex-party injunction of five out of the six governorship aspirants recognizing the delegates elected under the leadership of the former state chairman of the party, Soji Adagunondo. By implications, those elected through ad hoc delegates Congress of the party about two weeks ago are not recognized. But the party, through its council, says nothing has changed and the governorship primary election of the party will hold on Tuesday 8th of March. The ad hoc delegates congress of the People's Democratic Party in Oshun State was held more than a week ago. A few days after, five of the six governorship aspirants of the party approached the state high court, saying that they do not recognize the delegates that emerged from the Congress. The court granted their prayer. They are here celebrating the court injunction, recognizing the delegates elected during Soji Adagunodo's tenure. We had a court judgment on Thursday, um, and we had substituted service. Um, and the court has mandated that it's the 215 wards, uh, the delegates from those wards that are the authentic and valid delegates uh, for primary elections in Oshu State. The objective is to ensure PDP presents credible candidates during the July 16th governorship election. We don't want any... Uh, just any non-entity, let me put it that way, just anybody who has no name, who has no pedigree, to come ahead uh, the government of PDP in Oshun State. What is the sense in the party going through a process that is defective to, to, to produce a candidate that will be disqualified? Why? We want a party, we want our party to have a candidate that would stand the test of time, that would go out there win the election and sustain that victory. The aspirants promise to support whoever emerges as the governorship candidate of the party. Whoever have picked amongst the, uh, the five of us, so we are, we are good to go. Reacting to the court injunction, one of the PDP councils, Ashimu Abioye, said a stay of execution had been filed. He said there is no going back on the primary election as planned. The two court orders that we are referring to even though they have been appealed against, are not against the Congress. They are not saying that the Congress should not hold. So the order of the no court has stopped the Congress of a party that is holding on Tuesday. Abuya stressed that with the recently signed 2022 Electoral Act, no state high court has jurisdiction over intra and inter party matters. The ad hoc delegates congress of the People's Democratic Party in Ocean State was held more than a week ago. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.